Got off work early today. Said, hmm, what am I gonna do? Shoot. Walked in the house, saw my canoe sitting there, and went, oh, oh, hell yeah, man. Yep, buddy. Yep, yep, yep. Yep, yep, yep. Out here on Empire Lakes. Loving it. Living life, living life. Time to get to the lake. All right, made it to the lake. Got my boat, dumped it off the truck over here. Threw it, everything in it that I needed for today, not a whole lot. That bucket's got my invasive species permit in there and uh, first aid kit. Extra paddle. Oh, this black paddle right here, this is new. Paid $10 for that. Yeah, $10 at the thrift store. Can't go wrong in there, man. Woo-hoo. Oh, also got a new new seat there. Paid $2 for that. So let's see how that works out. You know how the last one did. All right, I am out on the water, finally. Yes, sir. It's kind of windy out there on the upper lake. So I went to the lower lake, which is a very shallow lake. This will do good for me paddling. All kinds of crazy, weird timber over there. We'll have to go check that out. Let's look at those creepy timbers. It's kind of like being in a swamp. Waiting for the gators to show up. Yes, sir. Waiting for them gators. Pretty crazy spot. This is a test of my canoe navigating skills here on how to get my boat through this area without hitting a whole lot. What? Not that easy to paddle and film at the same time. Uh, little tight, little tight. Nevertheless, so neat, isn't it? So neat. That organ line, baby. The ducks. What's up, guys? Yeah? Guys catch any fish? Huh? Huh? No? Alright. Carry on. Well, it makes a trippy sound going through all these lilies. When I was a kid, we used to go whitewater rafting, and the raft guys used to yell at people who were lily dipping, which meant that they were barely sticking their paddle in the water. Now that I'm paddling through lily pads, I know now where that comes from. Because uh, if you stick your paddle in the water too deep, it comes up with all these lily pads stuck on it, so you gotta just dip it, lily dip. All right, so this ancient old bridge here is part of the trail system for this park. There used to be a bike path going over it and a running path connecting that side to that side. It's the only way to get across this side of the lake. As you can see, it has been pretty jacked up for a long time. Now we're gonna run into it. Uh, damn. I would have been able to get it on the film, but that is an osprey nest. And there's an osprey that just landed. I don't know if she's got young out there or not. All right, going after some better shots of that osprey. Let's see what the wind does to me here. I come across the point of the island. my paddle in the boat or lose it. Oh, there it is, it's flying. I think it's threatened by me, to be honest with you. Just went back to its nest over there. Boy, the sun is making this bird even more harder to film over here. This might be the last bit of her I get. I'm pretty close now. She doesn't seem to be upset with, upset with me anymore, though. Come ashore on the island to find treasure. Yes, indeed. Blackberries. Treasure, indeed. Treasure, indeed.
the end of this log jam right here takes you out to the creek. Less than a half a mile, it'll be in the ocean. Okay, a couple things on the canoe here. After looking on the internet, found out that if you're solo in a double canoe, you're supposed to turn it around and sit on the front seat. It'll put you more towards the center. So, I like to be a little bit more towards the center. So I actually put my canoe seat right here against what would be the front seat going this direction. And I'll tell you what, it performed fantastically like that. They definitely made it to do it. Just kept my bucket right there, made a nice little table. This would be a good fishing setup. I do want to get a little better chair though, for sure. Loving this old town. Well, time to head back in now. It's starting to get a little late. I gotta get up early. Paddle my butt off out here. It's a good exercise. I might do this more often. Good time, enjoying it. Thank you for watching. God bless.